What's going on you guys? It's George and welcome back to my channel. Or, welcome to my channel. I'm here with Kylie and I want to share with you guys if there's one ingredient of skincare that you could absolutely not live without, what would it be? For me, it is vitamin C. I include some variation of vitamin C in my everyday skincare routine, typically a serum because it has many beautiful benefits. From evening out your skin tone, shielding you from pollution, hydration, and keeps your skin looking younger, which we all want. Today I'm talking about a skincare company that I've been looking forward to sharing with you guys. I've been trying out these two products about two months now, and these are from the Meme Boxes line, I Do Care. I have the Bright Side Up Brightening Vitamin C Serum, which is a jelly, and Thirst Things First, the Revitalizing Vitamin C Mist Mask. And I cannot wait to share my experience with you guys, so keep on watching. Meanbox creates private in-house labels inspired by K-Beauty. They were actually founded in Korea and now they're based out of San Francisco. And basically, Meanbox is like the house and they sell many different brands such as I Do Care, which you can find these products at us.meanbox.com. Of course, I will leave them in the description down below so you can check them out yourself. Guys, There's this is no joke. This is not a gimmick. Their packaging is a beautiful, which we will get to in a little bit, but definitely check them out. I'm gonna start this off with the Revitalizing Vitamin C Mist Mask. Thirst things first. For all you thirsty people out there, you thirsties, take a sip. Honestly, this is this is something that I incorporated within my everyday skincare routine for the past two months, and I have to say, off the bat, I fell in love with this product, guys. This is a leave-on mask, and the only type of leave-on mask that I've ever tried is a sleeping mask, because you you know sleep with it, wash off in the morning, um, or not, but I do. And um, yeah, this is something that you could actually spray throughout the entire day, and it is, it is beautiful, guys. Let me tell you, the description for this on the website is rich. It says here, quench skin's thirst with this dual-layered water plus oil formula that features vitamin C, rich pomegranate to brighten the look of skin, plus lemon peel oil to help retain moisture. Used throughout the day to take the complexion from dull to dewy, or a night as a leave-on mask. So you could leave this on as a, like a nighttime mask as well. Honestly, with my experience using this during the day, I've had no problem. Um, my skin is oily to dry. Sometimes it's a little bit more dry than I would want it to be, but this is a nice pick me up. Just like the description says, it is exactly that. If your face is feeling parched, if you need a little lift, give yourself a spray, shake it up though before you spray it, and problem solved. It smells amazing. That is, it's a very citrusy scent, if you ask me. I don't know, it just reminds me of like orange juice. Don't get me wrong though, it is not an overpowering scent. It is not a smell that is gonna like stick to your face and look like it's stuck to your nose and you just smell like orange juice the entire day. No, that is not it. It's a very refreshing, it is a very like, it's a wake up scent, it's beautiful. If you do enjoy like citrus smells at first spritz, you'll appreciate it, but it does go away. Packaging though guys, let's, let's talk about this packaging. I Do Care's packaging is beautiful. Color is cool, it really stands out, and all of I Do Care's products have like a really cool color scheme, so I appreciate that. Although the bottle is plastic, it doesn't feel cheap at all. Thirst Things First actually goes for $19, and currently I only seen one size on their website, which is 2.7 fluid ounces. Um, it's not a huge bottle, but it's worth it, honestly. I've experienced everything that this product claims to do. I'm gonna list the ingredients for the mist right here so you guys can check them out yourself. There's a lot of great ingredients in this, guys. Not gonna lie. And if you haven't noticed, or maybe you haven't noticed, there's actually two layers to the solution. Might be a little weird, but I'm gonna tell you why there's two layers. The top layer helps revitalize the skin and lock in moisture, thanks to a blend of lemon peel oil and apple seed oil. And the bottom layer works to hydrate, nourish, and brighten the complexion using antioxidant, rich pomegranate extract, and rich with radiance boosting vitamin C and vitamin K. Love that, guys. The mist, 19 bucks. It is a steal for me. I, I love this, guys. I'm living for this mist. This is something that I see myself purchasing over and over again. Now we have Bright Side Up Brightening Vitamin C Serum. Guys, this is a jelly serum. I've never used anything like this before in my life. I've used a gel before, like a cooling gel type moisturizer thing, but um, this, this is unique. This formula is unique, this whole product is unique. And I found the website description of this product to be really cool as well. And that's one thing I do care really does conquer is describing their products. It's um, worded very, very uh, appealingly, if that's even a word. Uh, it says here, get your daily dose of vitamins with this lightweight jelly serum that gives skin an instantly 
instant plumper look. We love a good plump, right? It's packed with nourishing vitamin C, E, and B5, plus antioxidant-rich grapefruit to bring dull skin back to the bright side. Love that, guys. We want our skin to be bright. We want it to be, I guess, plump. Plump's a good thing. I learned that from my friend Morgan. Um, I guess we want to look plump. This is actually 1.01 fluid ounces, decent size. That's pretty much like comparable to any other serum that I have, and this is $25. Um, it's a bit pricey, guys. I'll get to that in a little bit if I feel like it's worth that or not. But now I have to say the serum took a little bit of getting used to. One, it's because it's jelly and you're going to say like, so what? It's jelly. It's no big deal. It kind of was. Um, I like to put my serums on before I apply my moisturizer at nighttime and at daytime. So with this right here, the applicator, and this cool thing is it has the applicator. I love applicators when it comes to products because it prevents you from touching the product and it manages, it helps you like manage how much of the product you use. So great tip right there. But when you go to suck it in, it can be a little complicated. Uh, for some reason, the applicator doesn't like to pick up a lot of the gel. Either way though, guys, the serum, the formula spoke for itself. It is unique and I, it really does leave your skin glowing. I've noticed my skin had more of an even complexion and also soft for days. I love that, guys. We want a smooth skin. We want baby soft skin. We want to feel like an infant, right? So that's that's pretty much what this did. I'm not gonna lie, it really does leave your skin feeling soft and even. Um, right now we're fluctuating between seasons and temperature here in PA, so um, my skin can be really red one minute and just pale. You guys can check out the ingredients for the serum right here. Pretty great ingredients all around, but there's just a few that actually stood out to me. The grapefruit extract being one of them. The antioxidant rich. Fruit extract is naturally enriched with the vitamin C known to reduce the visible signs of premature aging over time. Love that. Need that. Vitamin E and vitamin B5, which is known to condition the skin, helping replenish moisture levels and relieve dryness. So that's something that I absolutely need to include within, within my skincare like every day, which is why I use vitamin C every day. Um, looks like vitamin E and B5 do that as well. Packaging guys, let me tell you, just like the mist, this is beautiful. There's nothing about this packaging that I don't like. I believe this is glass. It feels like a glass. Maybe it's plastic, I don't know. Either way, it feels expensive. It does not feel like a cheap product. The color is unique and it has an applicator, living for that. And it's like the same color all around. The you know applicator, the jar, it's beautiful. Enough said about the packaging, guys. Overall, do I believe this product's worth buying? Mist 100%, I'm living for this mist, guys. 19 bucks. Good size, great quality, and you really do see difference. Same goes for the serum, 25 bucks though. Would I purchase this again? Maybe, I don't know. But as of my experience so far using this for about two months, I'm loving it, so we'll see. But guys, I do care, check them out. Their shop will be in the description down below. This is not a sponsorship or a ad or anything like that. This is just my personal experience using these products. So hopefully you guys found this to be entertaining, fun. I know I did. And I was looking forward to sharing this experience with you guys because I do care is extremely unique. I saved onto the box from when they originally sent me the product because I wanted to share this on video. Look at how their products come. Their box is absolutely beautiful and it just it wakes you up it makes you feel welcomed and even the boxes this is for the mist that these come in beautiful the same color as the actual jar it's just there's so much effort put into this company detail wise that i absolutely appreciate and it's not just gimmicky like i know there's brands out there that are all about details and like looking appealing their formula speaks for itself and they are affordable I know I said before, 25 bucks is a lot. I don't know, maybe it's not, maybe it's not. I don't know guys, I'm living for these products. I do care. I don't wanna push these on you guys too much, but I do care. I really do care. I love these products. So if you guys found this video to be helpful or fun, give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel, that'd be much appreciated. It goes a long way, share this video and share the love and also hit the notification bell because I upload videos weekly. So you might as well follow me on this YouTube journey. And my Instagram is right here if you'd like to give that a follow. But until next time, say thanks, give compliments and think positive. And I'll catch you in the next video. Bye guys.